This is Parker with uh, Synthesis up in Chico. We've got Jordan and Nick here from As They Lay Dine. How are you guys doing? Good, dude. Good. Wonderful. All right, you guys. How's the tour going so far? This is only the second stop on the tour, but uh, so far so good. The uh, the weather's a lot nicer than the last time we toured in the States so far. Yeah. Um, we haven't gotten to Canada yet, but yeah, so far everything's just great. Got you guys sitting out here in the sun. Yeah. A little bacon right now. How's the tour going for you right now? Good. I mean, you know, you summed it up pretty good. You know, I mean, the weather has been uh, been pretty good, but I know we're going to be uh, hitting some pretty nasty stuff up in Canada. Yeah. So I think we're just going to try to soak up the sun while we can. <laughs> All right, you guys, that sounds pretty cool. So how long is this tour going to be going on for? Do you know, Jordan? I think uh, it's like 23rd of May is the last show. All right. Uh, We'll say a, a month. month. I think it's yeah, only, like exactly a month, actually. Yeah. And then you guys got the Warp Tour coming up, right? Yeah, we've got a little bit of time off playing one festival in between, and then we start doing the first half of Warp that we missed last year. So that starts on June 18th, I believe. Is, is that right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we'll be doing it for about a month then. All right. Are you uh, stoked about doing Warp Tour? Yeah, yeah. I mean, last time we had, a, you know, it was really cool, and the shows were awesome, and fans were awesome, and. Uh, you know, it gets a little hot, but, yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, you wear shorts and try to stay cool, and it's okay, you know? Now, Jordan, and, uh, they're saying that uh, you're becoming one of the best metal drummers out there right now. What do you think about that? Uh, Them saying that about you. I don't, I, it makes me nervous, <laughs> I guess, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I definitely, uh, you know, don't think that highly of myself, or, you know, yeah. to, to ever claim such a... Such a thing, but um, yeah, you know, it's really. I mean, you know, I mean, it's flattering. I guess it's it's cool to, you know, I guess for people to even say like, you know, say that. You know, oh, absolutely. What do you think about him being a drummer? Think he's good? Yeah, he holds down the fort. No, I'm just kidding. Jordan's a sick drummer. It's kind of weird just saying like with him right there, like yeah, yeah, he's so good. <laughs> like he can do this and this. Um, yeah, stoked to you know, have him playing drums every night because he's usually the one keeping it all together while I'm off, like, hitting wrong notes and sounding horrible, so, yeah. yeah. Well, you guys got uh, three albums out right now, Frail Words Collapse, Shadows Are Security, and Ocean Between Us. Uh, now, with Frail Words Collapse, that's a very different from the last two you guys released. Uh, what made you, like, go into that differently? Because with Frail Words Collapse, there's, like, a lot more screaming. There's some some little bit of singing, but with uh, Shadows Are Security and Ocean Between Us, there's like a lot more chorus singing. Like, what what made you guys go like try and go in that direction? Well, I think it was just a natural evolution of the band. You know, the biggest part of that, you know, the change in sound was, uh, you know, I guess the change in writers. Right. Or, I mean, the addition of new writers. Um, you know, because Frailwood's Collapse, we uh, Tim and I, mo most of Tim and I just wrote that thing together, yeah. and uh, you know, our old guitar player as well. And um, and then Shadow Security, Phil came in and started writing a little bit. And then this album, like, Nick wrote a lot more. Right. And I think everybody collectively, like, just, you know, was, um, you know, working together, you know, with each other, you know, more so than just, like, individuals writing songs and stuff. So, yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, I think, you know, we've, we've gone about writing uh, each album, like, differently. And, uh, you know, it's kind of like the way, way the way it came out, you know? Yeah. So. How do you feel about that? I think it's just, you know, when you go into writing an album, you just do what you want to do and uh i don't know we as we get better at our instruments and like listen to more music and just grow older we have new ideas and we wouldn't want to i guess just recreate things that we've already done yeah and if say if we are trying to write a song that's like hey let's write you know a very riff based melodic fast paced um like song we wouldn't try and do it the same way we did on the album before we just try and invent new ways to to maybe say the same thing or do yeah. it just i don't know just get a little creative try and progress try something new. it's all yeah because you i don't think that any of us could feel good about what we're doing if we felt like we were just kind of regurgitating the yeah, same thing doing the same thing over so, and over with every cd yeah so i just think it's it's natural for each album to sound different than the next yeah. or than the one for it all right now i know you like indiana jones right have you seen the new preview for the new Indiana Jones coming out? Mm -hmm. What do you think uh, about that? You think it's gonna be good or? Oh yeah, I'm really excited about it. So I can't, cannot wait to watch it. So yeah. The first day it comes out, I'm gonna be there. So. 
Awesome. Um, now with you guys, you guys' this band, you guys have a lot of positive energy, like with all like your lyrics and stuff like that. That's like not all like about killing and all that weird stuff. Like you guys are just like really positive, like with your guys' energy. Um, the fans can listen to it. You know, it's not cussing in your guys' CDs. Um, and I think that's like really good. You know, like every any kid can go out there and buy your guys' album without that explicit lyrics thing on it. Um, do, do you guys like a do you like your positive energy? Is that what you guys wanted to go for? Just like a nice positive yeah. for the kids out there? Well, you know, I don't think we, we specifically like tailor our music to be acceptable to like just young kids. You know, yeah. like we're not we're not trying to be like the PG-13 band or right. or even PG band for that matter. I just think that's we just do what we do and like we are who we are. And uh, we're not those kind of guys in real life. So right. naturally our music wouldn't be like that. Yeah. You know, if you hung out with us, you wouldn't hear us dropping F-bombs or like just being negative guys we we try and just you know look at the sunny side of life right. and then uh write heavy dark menacing music what's well, a good thing it's a good thing to have some positive bands out there but i don't have negative stuff to say all the time right yeah yeah you know i just good to relate to some some music to relate to well you know it's it it, it doesn't like it's not saying that everybody relates to uh well, yeah. like positive music because i know there's some bands that are just kind of like downer bands or like a little bit more on the the like bum out side of things i guess yeah. and um i know i like to listen to those bands on cloudy days or when i you know it just we do what we do and we just try and stay honest to like who we are as people and musicians Absolutely. and i think that's just it's the best you can do or it's what you should do yeah so an ocean between us just came out in august do you guys maybe plan on going in the studio anytime soon are you guys kind of staying on the down low um, we're just gonna continue touring on this record, and uh, probably through fall, and uh, you know, kind of see what happens. We'll probably, you know, take a little bit of time off, you know, like, yeah. and uh, and start writing, and um, yeah, just kind of see what happens. You know, we we really really don't know. So. Yeah. But. All right, you guys. Well, thank you very much for uh, coming out here and letting us interview you guys. You guys are an amazing yeah. band. Sure. Thanks. Man. Thank you very much. All right, we got some <laughs> a little thing of this. All right, this is uh, Parker with The Synthesis. Check us out at synthesis.net. Peace out, guys. Thank you.